drive from her to JDM. Is Hold on, try it again, try it again, try it again, because I was talking over you. Damn it, Balder! <laughs> 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 All right, so today we're gonna do another challenge on Fortune Island. Last time, if you saw the video, we actually raced uh, supercars off road. So uh, that was really hurricane. fun. Yes, and the Inner Tram <laughs> Hurricane won that one. Anyways, so today's challenge is going to involve drift cars. Um, it should have been obvious when we traveled here, but uh, yeah. So we're gonna do a budget drift car build. The rules oh, are: God. you're Six. gonna only spend fifty thousand credits. And only 50,000 credits oh, easy, in total. Easy. Yes. Are we no auction, house? auction house. No auction house. Damn. Wait. Yep. On, on yep. Car? So 50,000, like including total. the car and upgrades. Okay. Bruh. Anything All right. allowed. So uh, are you guys ready? Yep. yep. Yeah, sure. Awesome. Yes, we're going to meet up on top of the mountain. All right. We're now on top of the mountain. We've got all of our cars. Me, I'm taking my Corvette. Uh, Kiwi is taking his, uh, Sylvia there. Patrick's taking another Corvette, because we, great minds thinks alike. Uh, Flareman is taking his, uh, crowd killer. <laughs> hey! Ewan has his CRX. <laughs> uh, Wisconsin Gamer, or Ethan, has his S2K. Uh, Glint Eastwood has his, uh, G uh 3000 GT. Uh, Brandon has his S2K. NRK has a, what was that, midget? Austin Healy. It's a Sprite. An Austin Healy, there we go. It's fun size, man. Sprite, it's fun size, small. my bad. Austin Healy. Rodriguez has a uh, another Sylvia. And Savannah has an RX-7. Beautiful choice. Anyways, who wants to go first? Me? I want to go first. I will. Alright, so Max, since you said me first, you can go first. And for our first one, we have Max, a.k.a. M. Flareman, in his yellow S550 Mustang, six-speed manual. He is very confident in this build, and I think he might have a good chance here. I'm not Max confident is a talented in this build. <laughs> I'm an import guy, man. Why did I pick this? You're a Porsche guy. Shut up. All right, go ahead. <laughs> Count it down. Oh, um, okay. Special prop. <laughs> <laughs> and off he goes. <laughs> Down the first turn, he's gonna go in the first corner. He's taking an inside line, and he's going outside. Rips the A break, and he's taking a very hey, wide up. line through there, going inside. This is looking good. Come it's on. looking pretty good through there. You're in the next corner. Here come the S's. That is a very nice line through there. Not perfect, but very good. Very good for points, and he's keeping his speed very well. Oh, he's losing a bit of angle there through that corner, sacrificing a bit of speed. And into the final corner, he takes a massive... Blah. He rips the Ebra. That's what he did. Woo! <laughs> 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 there goes M. Flareman <laughs> with his first run. And for our second driver, we got Brian, a.k.a. Nguyen Media, and a white JDM Honda CRX SIR. Oh. Rear-wheel drive converted. Short wheelbase, and I'm not sure how it's going to work out for him. It's really going to be able to be thrown around well, it doesn't very doesn't look easily, like he has a lot of angle. Can I talk? Alright, count it down. I don't like ESPN. <laughs> and goes. He starts, starts sideways a little bit. He's not bringing too much speed to that corner, but then again, he doesn't need to to get a massive amount of angle from that CRX. Into the first corner, he's going right down the middle. Not Ooh, I hear a turbo he's inside that car inside right there. He can't hold the drift as well as Max could in the Mustang, which is going to be very conflicting for him in his points. But let's see. Maybe Dude, he looks way faster, though. It's a Honda. It can't be fast. <laughs> <laughs> well, I also don't know what my run looked like from the outside, so I can't really. Compare. It looked really he's slow. The just tight saying. Line through there. This second Dude, half I don't think the Mustang was big very good for this. Those sides. Looking pretty good now. I don't know how it's going to look compared to Max, but I think that this could be a runner, a good runner up. Who knows? We don't know until we know, right? He could just spin off and pull a Brandon Niwa. I am genuinely scared about my sore now, guys. 
Oh, you're not gonna be scared when I. Oh, holy crap! What score. an angle! Really go through there. Woo! Yeah, that's gonna give him an extra thousand points or so. Look at how smiley Next my car is. Next up is, is the scrub lord named Brandon Niwa in a spoon racing liveried Honda S2000 CR. <laughs> Going for the VTAC there. Number 69, he thinks that's funny. He thinks he's a really funny guy. In reality, he really isn't. Comedy. He has achieved comedy. Let's see how he does. V8 eater is his license plate. Let's see if he'll eat some V8. Brandon, are you ready? Maybe. <laughs> and into the first corner. He seems to be taking an inside line, but he's gonna go out. Um, yeah, that's not much angle Shit. there, buddy. I don't think you're really drifting that, but um, yeah, there you go. now you're drifting. Looking pretty good through that corner so far. Getting quite a bit of angle, not too high speed, but then again, you can't really get much speed through there with such a low power output compared to the V8s that we have in this competition today. Starting to Dude, nail those transitions, and it is gets starting to rain. Rain. That might help us tremendously. To starting a storm here on time. Fortune Island. That might help us score. The club racer variant of the S2000 oh. would grip through corners had it not been for rain. So this might help Brandon score, give him an extra couple 10,000 points. And Ooh. he is across the line, does a skid for style. And next up, level 69, nice prestige one. We got the black. Nissan S chassis, S14 to be exact, 1994 model. We got Kiwi. Kiwi, are you ready? Y yep. <laughs> <laughs> and off he goes. So off key in the smoke. And into the first corner. Not much oh, angle I made there at choices. all. Taking an outside line now, he's getting a little bit more angle, starting to pick up some speed. Well, I have nailing those transitions drift, there. So. It seems to be a bit of a running theme here that people are nailing transitions on the second half of the course. Maybe it's because of the steeper incline, or they're getting much better hang of their cars as they are. This is the first time driving cars. No tuning and testing here today. This is completely sight unseen, blind driving. Definitely a bit of a risk when in a competition so fierce as this. Coming into the last corner now, clipping some pylons in the inside line. Not going to hurt his score too much, and he is going across the line now. From Wisconsin, surprisingly, we have the Wisconsin Gamer, a.k.a. Ethan, in another Honda S2000 CR. We'll see how this serves him today. Definitely interesting, the abundance of VTEC cars here today. So we'll see how this serves him. Seems to have bigger wheels or something. I don't like the green. Looks like mint chocolate chip ice cream, but <laughs> who knows? Maybe it'll help them. I like it's the blue. blue on my screen. No, the wheels. wheels. This is cheese really going for that Wisconsin oh. theme here. Very I don't patriotic really see the of you. Mr. E36 powered S2000, are you ready? Yes, I am! <laughs> and off he goes for the first time ever. No movie magic going on here. Takes oh, a nice God. line into the corners. Oh, God. Not too aggressive, oh, though. Oh, Lord. Oh. Okay. Very slow through there. Maybe the older Ooh. BMW power is not favored in this situation. We don't know until we know. Oh! oh it's it's all right. I'm good. I'm good. I got this. <laughs> he I still got has this. points, apparently. He I got almost this. spun it again. This is very I, interesting. I got this. Gentlemen. I got this. Gentlemen. <laughs> if he does get the lowest score, we will be will proud of you, and you deserve a virtual a cookie from Paul Nisman. Oh. And he spins out again! Almost hits the, what animals are there there? Beers. Sheep. Cows? Sheep? I don't know. Almost yeah, hits sheep. them. Those appear to be I, sheep. I can't tell. <laughs> and oh, and he's backwards <laughs> again! <laughs> oh <laughs> my! Well, this yeah, definitely I is failed. a certified Mona you Lisa failed? moment, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, I failed. Ready? And next up, we have Glint Eastwood 41 in the rear-wheel drive swap Mitsubishi GTO or 3000 GT for the U.S. market. We'll see how this works for him. Definitely different from the other cars we're seeing today, as it does have six cylinders. But then again, Ethan's car did have six cylinders too, and he DNF, so maybe it'll be a DNF. I don't know. <laughs> Glint Actually, it's a Dodge Stealth. God. Yeah, this is my Dodge Stealth uh, Turbo RT. Please give me that beautiful <laughs> recorder countdown. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Dude, and off he goes. Oh Very smoky start. This could be good for him because 
He might it have much looks more power than, than the other people. Maybe a small torquey V6 is what you need. I don't know. We'll find out. I think we'll do a top three. I don't Spoiler know. Spoiler alert. I get Find that. out this week on Top Skid. Top Ping. <laughs> top Ping. Top, yeah. top, top Ping. ping. Going into the final corner now, looking pretty good, taking some aggressive line through there, cutting in, and then going out. Maybe that's the way to go, ladies and gentlemen. That looks way better than this. Maybe they're Damn just it. not good at holding the line. And across the line for Glenn Eastwood. And Man, next up, we have Nick, a.k.a. Evil Monkey, in the 1958 Austin Healy Sprite. Very small car, and very different to everything else we've been seeing here today. This could go one or two ways. He could yeet it off a cliff or yeet it off a cliff. We don't know yet. <laughs> this could be interesting. Very happy looking car. In fact, my uncle had one. Ooh. And it was a piece of shit. I also have a piece of shit next to my nightstand. And I can send a picture of that to Palmer. Okay. At go the on. earliest convenience. Anyways, Nick, are you ready to go? Sadly. <laughs> That means go! <laughs> He's looking good too. Whoa! Look wow. at that thing go! The slow speed oh, is oh, very oh, deceiving. Oh, oh, Look at oh. that line through there. Oh my Jesus. god! It's fantastic! Here the at RS6 has an amazing drifting. run though. Look at that thing. It has Look not... at that drift for the RS6. <laughs> and Savannah has left the session. Probably due to being AFK for too long. Ah. Anyways, looking very good through there. On the final corner, this could be quite an interesting score. <laughs> and next up we have Javi, aka Ultra Rodriguez, in a S14, another S14, 94 model, just like the black one we had before. Javi, what engine is that thing running? Stock. Stock engine, like the S14 before, I believe if I'm correct. <laughs> now, yep. this is a pretty interesting livery, samurai livery. I kind of like it. Dig it. It'll look good going sideways. Hopefully going sideways and not going sideways off a cliff. Anyways, Javi, <laughs> are you ready to go? Yes. There we go. <laughs> and he jumps jump the gun. On the tongue, and off he goes. It's starting to storm here at 4chan Island. <laughs> so this will help him tremendously through this run, but then again, we are not postponing runs due to weather because we are not the British. <laughs> oh. Looks like a Paul, is there something you need to tell us? Build. No, I mean, as long as you meet the criteria of um, $50,000, you should be good. Where's your car wheel drive swap? Yes. Oh. No, 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 that's okay, that's okay, because did you meet the $50,000, uh... Yes, I did. Okay, then he met, he's, he's qualified. Is that I'm yes ready. or no? Yes, I'm ready. Okay. This is going to be an interesting tandem between the A and the B class. He takes the B class very easily. Well, they're taking a very nice line through there. Anyways. Actually, I was talking to my mom. Thank you. Oh, rip. <laughs> Anyways, back to Polder. Taking some really nice lines through there. Not too huh? risky, though. What? Maybe this is what you need. Nice. And Kiwi has left the party. Woo! Cuts to the grass there. Might sacrifice a couple points. Drives past the penultimate Corvette Z06. That is mine. Anyways, looking pretty good through there. Not, not anything to complain about. I mean, it's a nice run. I mean, it's pretty oh, good safe. there. Yeah, I mean... Oh. Ah! Oh, oh, I, 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 I have punished him to take your wrists and no, 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 no. I like what you're doing. <laughs> coming and coming to the near end of the track. A lot of traffic up here, but Dude, again, I it is a drift I genuinely hate that this BMW is a good guard guard rail. reaction. Well, that might do something to the score. It might not. Who knows? We'll see in the final score. Oh, no. Oh. My screen, Patrick. I stalled it. I pulled a pole there. Yes, you did. <laughs> you stalled that car so easily, dude. It's so stupid. You didn't pull a pole there until you go off the track and lose all of your score. I bet you I still have a higher score than you. Uh, that's cap because you have zero. <laughs> uh, going into the final <laughs> corner. Goes with all the angle in the world. Almost across the line, and I cut the line! A few moments later... 
We're starting in 11th place with Savannah, and she got a DNHB, does not have batteries. For <laughs> so that is a DNHB for Savannah. In 10th place, we got the Wisca the Wisconsin, Wisconsin Gamer, Gamer with 69,490 points. Only seven what points a score. off from the golden number. <laughs> what, what a score. score. And Good in 9th place, we have Bordiger Palnar with... 173,743 points. Respectable yes, points. Come on. I because I spun out. In place, <laughs> yeah, Brendan, this will be the only time you will ever beat me in anything. In eighth place, we have Brandon with 222,828 points. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> in seventh place. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you should be happy. This is your first time beating me at something. <laughs> In seventh place, we have Kiwi with 226,943 points. Who is currently not present? Because In sixth place, with less than 1,000 points between seventh, we have Glint Eastwood with 227,898 points. Ooh. In fifth place, we have Nick with 232,962 points. Jeez. Can we let these traffic cars pass? Seriously, no. <laughs> Why are this next one will come as a surprise to all and every. In fourth place, M. Flareman with 258,517 points. So that was pretty solid. I will take that. I will definitely take that. Now this for our bullshit. top three. 7,000 <laughs> points between the top three. In third place, oh we God. have Ultra Rodriguez with... 290,000 points on the dot because he didn't get the recording, but, you know, that's okay. Holy crap. <laughs> okay. And in second place, Brian, uh, a.k.a. Oh Glenn my God. Media, with 294,061 points. Wow. And in wow. first place, that is me with 297,000 <laughs> <laughs> Patrick, 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 okay, so Patrick is the winner for the second freaking challenge in a row. So far, he's been undefeated. Ladies and gentlemen, if you want a $50,000 budget car, buy my Z06, not Palmer's, because his tend to spin out. My tune will be available <laughs> at KPK442YT on the tune shop now. And if you want the, the off-road Huracan from the last episode, you know where to find it. Nobody has downloaded it, so be the first one to download it. And I will tell Palmer about it, and he will give you a virtual cookie. Yes, Anyways, I will give you a virtual cookie. cookie. Alright, anyway, speaking about virtual cookie, if you leave a like, subscribe, and leave a comment, share this video, you will also get a virtual cookie, and you don't have to download PK's freaking... Yes, you <laughs> I'm do! Just I need I'm joking. my star cards back, because my Forza <laughs> account got corrupted. Ralph I'm just kidding. Me dirty, Anyways. I need the star cards. Funny Anyways, please leave a Look like, subscribe, and leave a comment, share it with your friends, and uh, yeah, if you guys want to see us do more of these types of challenges, please leave a like, give us at least 20 likes, and if we get that, then we'll do a part 2 of this challenge. So uh, yeah, I appreciate you guys for watching this video and sticking this far in the video. Uh, I will give you guys virtual cookies if you guys uh, leave a comment, and uh, yeah, subscribe, and uh, we'll see you guys you in the next challenge. Cookies. See ya!